Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Noble Omoni. To my faithful subscribers, welcome back. And if this is your first time, try to click on the subscribe button below and also click on the notification icon to get notified when I post a new video. Today you can see I'm dressed in my traditional outfit. I'm wearing Danshiki and Abitiaja. I'm going to be doing something new on my channel. Not totally different from what I have, but it's going to be new because I will be teaching you 50 Yoruba names and their meanings. I bet that you're going to enjoy this. But before I start, there's something Yoruba people say. It's a proverb. It says, Ile lao That basically means we have to look at the condition of the family or the house before we name a child when the child is born at that moment. So that is what make people, Yoruba people, name their child. So if you see a particular name, you will know that it's because something was happening around that time. That was why they named that child that name. Let me start with my name. My name is Omoni Riri Rido. Omoni basically means child is respect or child is honorable. But there is also Omoni. It's the difference is actually in the signs, and there's something we call like it's like a so, turning so far. So for instance, my name is Omoni Riri Rido. There is Omoni Remimi Do. So they mean closely the same thing, but the pronunciation is different. So that is that about my name. So Omoni, if I'm trying, I don't want to bore you with like stories of how names are. I told you already that Lila woke up to That means that they look at the station of the family before they name a child that particular name. So that is how my name is. Omoni is a using sex name, so it could be for both a guy or a girl. The next name I have is Adepu Sola. That means royalty adds to wealth. There's something you should know about Yoruba names also. If you have something like Ade, that means crown or royalty. It shows that the person is born from a royal family. So if you see Ade something, that means the person from a royal family. So Ade Busola, royalty adds to wealth. The next name is Bibire Koshe Fowora. That means a good or worthy bet is priceless. That's actually a very beautiful name. You can shorten it, you can call her either BB or Fowora. So it's usually ladies that bear this type of name. The next name is Ade Dolapo. I told you already that Ade means royalty from like or crown. So Ade Dolapo, that basically means crown mix wealth together. You know the person, the name is unisex. Both a guy and a girl can also be at that name. Moving on, we have Akonji. So Akonji basically means one whose touch gives life or Maida's touch. So Akonji is usually a masculine name. It's usually made for male children. It's a typical Yoruba name and it's actually a very wonderful name. At least from the meaning, you can know that it is really beautiful. So the next word is Adebimpe. From the way I've been explaining, you will notice that I, I said Ade means a person from royal family or it could mean a crown. So now Ade being paid basically means Ade be me pay. That is the crown begat me complete. So basically I am all with the crown. So that's just the meaning of that. It's usually a feminine name. Our next name is Ade Diwura, which means the crown became gold. The next name is Adeyinka, royalty surrounds me. Our next name is Abolaji. That means one who woke up with wealth. Adeolua, God's crown. Adedoin, the crown became honey or sweet. Adedamola, royalty combined with wealth. Adiola, the crown of wealth. Omosasinola, that means the child runs into affluence. We have Oluwa Toberu, that means the Lord is worthy to be feared. If you see anything that has Oluwa, 
that basically means God or the Lord. Then we have Sidroade or Shidroade. Open the eyes of royalty. Folusha. Under God's protective watch. Morolake. That means I have found wealth to cherish. Ewa Tomi. That means beauty is sufficient for me. Ewa Tomi. Beauty is sufficient for me. If you see anything that has to do with Ewa, just know it is beauty. And there is Ewa. That's means but Ewa means beauty. So Ewa Tomi means beauty is sufficient for me. You can call the person, it's usually a feminine name. You can call the person either Ewa or Tomi. Our next name is Okpemi Po. I have many tanks. We have Babalola. That means father is wealth. Babashola. That's different from Babalola. Baba. So if you see anything that's doing Baba, it means father. So Babashola now means father provides or make wealth. Or Molola. That means child is wealth. I'm sure you can see from Ola means wealth. Child is wealth for Omolola. Iritiola. That means the anticipation or hope of wealth. Olayemi. That means wealth befits me. Titilola. Titilola means everlasting wealth. Akwike, that's a conch Yoruba name. It's a there's something they call oriki. That's one of the things they use. Akwike means one called to pamper. Okikiola, the fame or prominence of wealth. So okiki means something that is very prominent or like something that is very famous. So okikiola means the prominence of wealth or the fame of wealth. Oluwa koni sola. That means the Lord added honey or sweetness to wealth. Oluwa tomi lola. That means the Lord is sufficient wealth for me. Oluwa fola bomi. That means the Lord covered me with wealth. Oluwa fikayomi. That means the Lord added to my joy. Oluwa bemileke. The Lord makes me triumphant. Kolawole brings wealth home. Olasheni, wealth is attainable. Folaring, that means walk with wealth. Ade tutu, Ade tutu means the crown is suiting a gentle royalty. Olabanji, that means wealth woke up with me. Olason komi, wealth moved closer to me afolabi that means one born with wealth the lord is worthy to be praised that means the lord is worthy to be worshipped adefe adefe means someone who is begged to be loved which is god brought my joy which is, I am God's own. Feyin Toluwa, that is Feyin Ti Oluwa, which means rely on God. Ano Oluwa Po, that means God's mercy is abundant. Oluwa Jomiloju, that means the Lord surprised me. Oluwa Feromi, that means God loves me. Oluwa Femi, also means God loves me. Okay guys, we've come to the end of this video. If you made it to the end, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like this video. And also, if I didn't mention your name in this video, you can comment your name down below and I'll do another video mentioning your name and the meaning. Also, you can, if you've heard of a Yoruba name and you don't know the meaning, tap the name or the name down in the comment section. I'll do another video explaining the meaning as well so i will put in each picture of the slides i did in the community section so you can have a screenshot and post if you found your name you can screenshot it and 
put on your DP and use it or even have a frame for it. So thank you for watching this video. Till I see you next time. Bye.